well it's Friday I'm back home I had to take all the axes back and those knives back took some restaurant knives back picked up some restaurant knives these are new knives new restaurant I should say if you remember correctly I think it was one of these and one of these three I did about five or six weeks for a guy I don't even know if I put it on video for a sample and uh, apparently he liked them but he waited till I got dull again so I went by and picked up I think it's nine here in it got to take him back to him in an hour or so he's big steak place roast pre prime rib all that stuff on weekends okay stand by no reports from anybody like I said if they had to go they had to go early in the morning or in the dark in the evening but we got a bad front coming through tonight I'm not sure we'll even have the knife gig tomorrow we're gonna try it but it looks sort of bleak at this moment I got my rice burner look at that a powered what do you call those things skateboard anyway loaded look at this mother nature is threatening I'll get trapped over there I guess the weather was so bad they moved us all inside under this overhang not all of us but mo most of us vegetables bakery guy coffee guy and Max the guy so dark back ahead I had to go back home get my light when I carried all those restaurant knives back yesterday they gave me one more they said they forgot I just sharpened it up here while I was uh, waiting for some action. This is a carbon knife for a roast beef, they said. Long taquito. Our well, first customer has overwhelmed us. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine knives and two pairs of scissors in this fancy case. Ergo edge or something it's called. Oh, this is like Mmm. Mother Nature. It's uh but it's in liquid sunshine on us now. Skylight with no light. Good for the plants though. Well, we had a gully washer. You saw that. I got to get this crap out of my truck now. I let the rain drop off a little teeny bit. But as I pull up, I see a package in my mailbox. Some guy called me from the market said, I can't get there, but I'm going to drop some knives off at your house. Let's see what we got here. Stand by me. Well, I see two globals and some weird looking red handle knife. And another one. Come out of there. Ah, oh, three and three. A para go global. Not in bad shape, but right? what little I can see. My knees, I've never seen anything like these before. They're big. Or this one's big, I should say. Says they are dig a dig agony d i g a n g i design. I'll have to look that up and see what I can find out about them. But they got beautiful handles on them and brass right there. I probably can polish that up a little bit. Make short squatty job like me. Nice handle. 
got a bigger size of that. Oh, this one got like a piece broke off of it. You see it? Yeah. Like it cracked off or something. Got some scratches up along there. This one's had a rough life, it looks like. Maybe this is one that was used all the time. This one doesn't look like it's ever been out of the box hardly. And this one, I've seen a little action. The Global's got the most of the action. Okay, I guess these are, I don't know what kind they are, I'll have to look up and see. But they're pretty fancy, I like them. Stand by. Everything's out of the washer. The sink, I should say. Where's the one that has the chip in it? There it is right there. The chip at the back. Now, right there, that's glory. G-L-O-R-Y, glory. That's all I'm going to show you right now. A friend of mine just brought it to me, and he made it. More to follow.